direct link between the two. For this study, the researchers looked at a total of 110 people that had signs of knee osteoarthritis or were at high risk of developing osteoarthritis of the knee. They compared these individuals to a total of 220 people who had no frequent symptoms at the baseline and did not develop any major knee pain throughout the study. At this sort of study, meniscus damage was detected in 38% of case group and 29% of control group. Meniscus damage was more common in the knees that had been operated or suffered serious injuries in the past. This is an exciting study which confirms my observations over the past few years. Patients who have severe knee pain and their MRI shows only minimal to moderate meniscus damage. And then there are patients who have minimal knee pain with a severe damage on the MRI. This is an important point since it indicates that there is minimal or no correlation between meniscus damage and the knee pain.